Jerry Baba. <laughs> okay, Mesa. No matter how much one may love another, the final walk is always run alone. Carrying one's karma. If truly deserving, then with one's master. What? I don't know. Say it. I don't know. Nothing? Okay. I'll repeat it. Hmm? Okay. No matter how much one may love another, you understood that? Yes. The final walk is always done alone. You got that? You understood what I'm saying? Eventually, they, uh, on the final way to go to Baba is on their own. They can't go together. Yeah, very nice. You mumbled. Say it loudly. <laughs> huh, what? Uh, when they're going back to Baba, that mm. means heaven, they have to go alone. They can't go together. Okay. Right? Yeah. Carrying one's karma. And they take their own karma, karma. also with them? Yeah. If truly deserving, then with one's master. If, like, if they have been a very good human being, mm. a very good soul, mm. then, hard, no? then they will go with their master to heaven. Yeah. Okay, so... Mm. Our lives we kind of spend usually all our actions, thoughts, words, deeds are reactions to people around us. Okay? It could be that we love somebody so much that our entire life is devoted to that person. Hmm? So you have family and some people say, oh, I have to be corrupt so that I can, you know, take care of my family. Corrupt. corrupt means doing wrong things. Okay? Oh, I have, I don't have time for prayer and giving a helping hand to someone because you see, I've got to earn more money for my family. I don't even have time to pray, I've got to travel. We have all these reasons and excuses for everything. Hmm? A woman will say, No, you can spend time in prayer. I can't spend time in prayer because I am taking care of the house. We all have countless excuses for everything. Yes. But eventually when we drop this body, when we leave this body, when this body dies, None of our loved ones are going to come along. Mm. Right? It's going to be us going alone. Mumbling? It's going to be us going alone. Alone. Okay? It's going to be us going alone is phenomenally wrong English. Okay. Us and alone? It's going to be... It's going to be each person going alone. alone. Right? Right. So the final walk is alone, sweetheart. We've got to start understanding that we've got to start taking decisions that come from the largest good for everybody. Right? Because eventually we have come with our karma and we are only going to go back with our karma, not with anybody around us. So anyone who says that I have sacrificed my entire well-being and my goodness for an individual is an idiot. Because that individual is not going to accompany you on your final walk. But can that individual? What? But can that individual? <laughs> what? <laughs> can that individual what? <laughs> We can't just intervention accompany that person. No. Why? Sweetheart, everybody's walk is alone. But why? Tell me, when you're going into a mall and they're checking with that electronic stuff, two adults have to go alone, no? 
Or can you say, I'm a family, we are all walking in. Huh? Do we do that? No. No, no? When, uh, when someone falls ill and is getting an injection, what the other person is also saying, no, even I want it, I want it, I want it. <laughs> no, no, maybe. So, the final walk is alone, sweetheart. We come with our karma, we go back with our karma. And if you have lived a life which is truly beautiful, then you will have your loved ones who have passed away be with you. And if you have led, led a life which is selfless, which is noble, then who knows, we might be lucky enough to have our Goddess God Guru taking us there. But none of our loved ones are going to be there who are on earth. No, Dad. Right? Right? So don't make excuses. Don't get so carried away with work, with people, with even a cause where you leave even God behind. Don't get so busy that you don't have time for even God. Each person has to have in a day, this is what Baba says, every day you know, should comprise of three things. There should be work happening, there should be prayers happening, and there should be playing happening. Work, pray, play. Okay? Hmm? Okay. Sometimes you have to work a little more so you have a little less time for prayers and playing. Some days you have more time for prayers, some days you have more time for playing. But every day needs to have these three things. Why? Because then you will be able to give your best to everyone around you and yourself. Okay, my sweetheart? So don't get so carried away, even in... Now imagine an individual only prays. And the child comes to the mom and says, Mom, I'm hungry. And the mom says, what is more important, God or food? Okay? For me, God is more important, so you go have a bag of chips, I'm not preparing anything. That's stupid. Right, sweetheart? But on the other hand, if the lady of the house is whole time in work and spends no time on herself and in prayer, even that is wrong. So the right mix is important for us. Only then will we be able to get and give the best of life in ourselves. Okay? You're just nodding for the sake of nodding. No, my baby, you understand me. Okay. Jai Baba. Jai Baba. Okay, today is Daughter's Day. We already said that. Happy Daughter's Day. Though I don't know what that means because every day is a Daughter's Day. Go.